Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm Olu Femi Shuwali and today we will be talking about some reasons why that man hasn't proposed to you yet. If you're on this page for the first time, welcome. And if this is not your first time on this show, welcome back. Without wasting much time, let's dive right into the video. The first reason why I think that man hasn't proposed is that he is not ready for marriage. As a guy myself, I know that if a guy isn't ready for marriage, there is no way you can force him except you get pregnant for him. Even when you get pregnant for him, a responsible guy that wants to accept the pregnancy will still not go take that step of getting married. He would rather have you as a baby mama. So I know for sure that if that guy is not you know, popping up that question, it might be because he's just not ready for marriage. He's not ready for that level of commitment. You know, being in a relationship and being married are two different levels of commitment. So that's just my take. The second reason why I think that man hasn't popped that important question, will you marry me? Might be that he doesn't see you as a wife material yet. As human beings, both male and female, we already have a certain picture of the kind of person we want to get married to or the kind of woman we want to marry she must be this she must be that you know i mean not just talking about the physical qualities mental qualities achievements education could be anything you know we we, we grade that wife material or husband material differently we see it differently so it's possible that it just doesn't see you as that wife material you know his own taste you know, and he's expecting you to probably, maybe there's something you're doing but not doing his way and he's expecting you to adjust or there's a way you act that he doesn't want you to be. I don't know if you get the picture but it might be that he just doesn't see you as a wife material yet. The third reason and can be a very important reason is that the man already has access to some things that he naturally should have access to in marriage what do i mean things like if you're already having sex you know you're already go to his house you, you you know you clean up the house you cook for him you wash clothes you sleep together you, it's possible that you're even cohabiting you know? okay so if we are not married but we are cohabiting we live together we have sex you cook for me, you know, you're already doing the things a wife should be doing. Then why should I ask you to be my wife again? Why should I ask you to marry me? Well, it's not as if if I want to marry you, get married eventually. But why what's the rush? There's no rush. There's no because something that I'm supposed to have access to in marriage, I already have access to it. And something I'm supposed to be enjoying in marriage, I'm already enjoying. You know? This is a very, very important reason and it affects a lot of people. So I don't even know why you're wondering. The reason he hasn't popped the question, the reason why he hasn't asked you to marry him, why should he? Because the things you're supposed to be giving him in marriage, you're already giving him now. So there's no reason for him to pop the question. The question might come eventually and it might not come. He, he's not losing. I mean, he's gaining. He had the one losing. Now, the fourth and final reason why he hasn't popped the question yet might be that he's considering his options. In a case where you are not the only person in the picture, where you are there, there, is, there are a few others, you know, around and is considering, you know, should I go for this person, should I go for this person? That might cause a delay in asking you to marry him or asking another person to be his wife, you know. If you are the only person in the picture, I mean, there's no hesitation. He knows you are the only person, this is the person I want to marry, this is the person I want to marry. But in a case where we have three people, where we have four people or even two people, he has to consider his options carefully so that it doesn't make a mistake, you know. And he might be looking at the person that will fumble, okay. First to fumble is out of the game. That might be the case. I can only speak for we guys. Maybe five women will come on sometimes to speak for the women. So there it is. We have come to the end of today's video. Please, if you haven't subscribed, do well to click on the subscribe button and encourage us, I beg. And also like the video and drop your comments in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, it will be.